Welcome everyone, in this video I'll guide you through the process of fixing the Steam Web Helper not responding. So make sure to follow the steps I'm about to show you and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. And now let's break it down. So the first thing that you want to do is come to your desktop and from here come down to your taskbar and right click on your taskbar as you can see. Now go ahead and open your task manager and from here what you want to do is locate the Steam Client Web Helper. As you can see, it's right here. Go ahead and click on it, then go down to the end task tab and click on it just like that. So once that's done, close down your task manager. And what you wanna do next is come down to the search box on the bottom left corner of your screen. Click on it and type Steam. As you can see, we have Steam appearing right here. What you wanna do next is right click on it and then click on to open file location. What's this gonna do is open you a folder like this and from here what you want to do is right click on the Steam app just like that and come down and press on open file location and this is gonna take you to the Steam folder. Now from here I want you to locate steam.exe which is the Steam application and now right click on it and then click on to properties. This will open you a window just like this one. Now, click onto the tab that says compatibility. And what you wanna do from here is to tick the box that says run this program in compatibility mode. And make sure this is selected to Windows 8, as you can see. And also don't forget to tick the box that says run this program as an administrator. Once you've done that, come down to this apply tab and click on it and then ok. Now close this down and now what you want to do is restore your PC. Once you've restarted your PC, open Steam and you should now be able to access it without facing the problem of the web helper not responding error. So that was all, thank you guys for watching this video, I hope it was useful and see you in the next one.